Hey guys and what is going on? Welcome back to another Wrath of the Lich King classic gold making video. In this one I'm going to be showing you a great way to make a whole heap of gold that is super super easy and it doesn't take much time whatsoever. And if you could have guessed already that is flipping on the auction house. So what our main goal is to do is basically buy things for a certain price of the market value and then resell them for more of the market value. And now to do all this, you're gonna need an add-on that is called TSM, which is actually for short Trade Skill Master. So it's this app right here. And this will actually track all the prices of all the items or the on your realm or not the region, just on all the realms all together. It tracks all the prices of all the items. And it is a great, great um, add-on to have, and it is a must to have when you're doing flipping. So there are multiple ways to go about flipping in Classic. Now some of the best ways would be flipping materials and common items that sell really good and have a good sell rate. Now things like that are like crafting materials, materials, certain materials, and a whole heap of things like that. Before we get into this video though, if you'd like to have all my TSM groups, um, settings, and import strings for flipping, how I'm going to show you in this video, my flipping guide will be the first link down below in the description box. I just want to get that out of the road just so you know where to go to actually be able to do this yourself properly and like everything I'm talking about. So, the main few things to flip would be materials, BOE items especially right now in the start of Wrath of the Lich King and then also twink items go really really good to flip and that would be the main the main three categories I'd like to um, flip in and make the most gold in. So in this video I'm going to show you what we're doing on this character. This is actually a character I made about two weeks ago and we made a series which is called 0 to 10,000 gold um, in classic from um, auction house only or using the auction house only and basically what we did with that we started off with no gold and we've been doing it for about two weeks now and we've already got like there's let's just have a look before we get into this so let's um, we'll empty everything out and list it all up and I'll just show you from the last two weeks we've started from zero gold and we went all the way up to what we have right now so what we'll do is now we'll clear out the, um, the the mail here and I'll list up the items that have not sold and then we'll see how much gold in sales we've got and then the total amount and we've made all this in less than two weeks starting from nothing so this just proves that anyone can do this um, this gold making method and be able to flip in classic also alrighty so we just finished grabbing things so we've got um, 1285 gold in the mailbox and the gold that we have on us and then let's go check the actual um, auction house because we just listed all our items that we've brought and invested in to reflip. So let's um let's show you just um a few of them before I get in exactly how you two can do this uh, flipping on the auction house. We'll just list these up and we'll see the total amount. And this is all in less than like two weeks, starting from nothing, like I've said. So it's pretty pretty crazy. And this is just by putting in like five minutes every day or every second day relisting the items buying new items with the new gold that we've made and um so yeah it's only like five to ten minutes per day of work we actually put in to make this so as you can see we've got um about 1900 gold in the ma in the inventory and then we also have 9k um worth of things that we've invested to resell and flip and this is all in less than like i think it's only been like 10 days or so but anyways how you two can do this basically it's all set up in TSM and so we use the TSM app and it tracks all the prices and a whole heap of data on the about the auction house on your specific uh, realm and how you set it up so to start off you can obviously have to download and install TSM and once you have that set up you can then make groups operations and settings which do specific things for you. Now in my flipping guide I actually have import strings which mean you can basically just copy and paste my exact ones into your TSM and you're ready to go 
and it'll do exactly what mine do and how I'm flipping right now. And it's the same as in the uh, the flipping challenge, if you want to watch that also, the zero to 10K flipping auction house only. But basically, everything is inside of that and you can plug it in straight to your TSM. You can just go simply to, for an example, you go to groups and you go to import group and you'll find this string, the import string in my flipping guide and you simply just copy it in here and then you'll have all of these set up with operations and settings and specific grouped items which I recommend flipping. And now what I do to simply do the flipping is we'll come to the auction house and I have this all set up and I can simply come to browse here and then select all of my flips or whichever one I want to search at the moment. So we do the material flip for an example or we can do all of them and we'll run a shopping scan. And what this will do is bring up the items and it'll bring up a percentage and the percentage on the side here is the percentage of the market value. And I like to buy things under 70% of the market value and then relist them with my TSM operations which will always make me profit when actually reselling the item by 20%. So there's a guaranteed 20% profit margin or we'll just list it at the 20% profit margin. So I never make less than 20% profit margin on everything I buy with the TSM settings I have set up which is a great, great way to make a lot of money because as you can see on this here, on the fell scales, we bought them for 40 silver average and then we're reselling them for one gold and 40, uh, 24 silver. Now this is great because we're actually still under the market value and a lot of people find this as a good deal and will buy this up. As you can see, this is our listing right here. And with the 20% up to 200% of the market value, with the profit, that's our TSM settings. Um, this allows us to do that and still make a whole heap of profit no matter what. So it'll be 20% profit or more. If no one's listing it, it'll go all the way up to like 200% of the market value, which could be a whole heap. So when we're actually buying things like this, so these here would be a perfect example. You've got your modes of water and your modes of fire. These are both very, very low price. They're at 30% of the market value. We'd buy them all up. Let's um, just have a look here. We'd buy them all up. We could even buy, so we could buy them all for the 15 silver ones, which are at 32% of the market value, or we could buy all of them, even buying the ones that are at 53 market value. And then this will reset us at, we'll relist them at 100 market value or under cutting the, the next listing. So we could buy all of these up, which we will do, and then we'll relist them for 100% of the market value, or we can undercut this guy, which is doing 322% of the market value. So we probably will, with our TSM settings that got set up, it probably will list it for one copper less than this guy right here. Until someone posts lower, then it will undercut them. And then if there's no one posting a post at the 200% of the market value. But anyways, so we can buy these all up and we're gonna make a whole heap of profit from that. And this is as simple as it is. I just do the scan, run the scan. There's a whole heap of items that you can keep on scanning. Like we've only done a little bit of it. You scan them all up. If you want it to be a quicker scan, you can just do less groups. Little, little groups will go quicker, obviously. Uh, you buy them up, then you simply come over obviously grab the item and to relist them it's very very simple so we just brought these for an average of um, we already had some brought before so they were all 15 silver that we just brought all these for we'll come back over and we'll relist and as you can see we've went from the 15 silver we paid for them and now we're reselling them for one gold and 19 silver so that is how it's done it's very very automated with my TSM settings, which you can find in my TSM uh, in my flipping guide, which will be linked down in the description box below, guys. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this short video. I can't really add all the details and absolutely everything. It will take absolutely forever in a video. It's all inside my flipping guide, like I mentioned. So if you want to get hold of that, you can. It's the link down below. Anyways, guys, take care. Until the next one, I'm out.